Welcome again to another new video. Going forward in list of venomous and non-venomous snakes, today we are going to talk about beautiful and mysterious looking, yet highly venomous snake which is known as monocled cobra. So let's move further, and have a look at some interesting facts of this snake. The monocled cobra, also called monocellate cobra, or Indian spitting cobra. It is a venomous cobra species found widely across South and Southeast Asia. Let's have a look at physical characteristics of it. The monocled cobra has an O-shaped, or monocellate hood pattern behind its head. Unlike that of the Indian cobra which has the spectacle pattern on back of its hood. The elongated nuchal ribs, enable a cobra to spread the neck into a hood. The body surface may be yellow, brown, gray, or blackish. It has a black spot on the lower surface of the hood on either side. And one or two black cross bars on the belly behind it. The rest of the belly is usually the same color as the back, but paler. As age advances, the snake becomes paler, wherein the adult is brownish or olivaceous. A pair of fixed anterior fangs is present. The largest fang recorded measured, 6.78 mm. Fangs are moderately adapted for spitting. Adult monocled cobras reach a length of 4.4 to 4.9 feet, with a tail length of 23 cm. Many larger snakes have been recorded, but they are rare. Adults can reach a maximum of 7.5 feet in length. The monocled cobra has 25 to 31 scales on the neck, 19 to 21 on the body, and 17 or 15 on the frontal of the vent. Habitat. It can adapt to a range of habitats, from natural to living near human population. It prefer habitats associated with water, such as paddy fields, swamps and mangroves. But lives also in grasslands, forests, agricultural land, including cities. Monocled cobras are terrestrial, and most active at night. In rice-growing areas, they hide in rodent burrows in the fields, and have become semi-aquatic in this type of habitat. Young babies feed mostly on frogs, fish and other aquatic species, whereas adults prey on small birds and mammals, snakes and fish. When disturbed, they prefer to escape. However, when threatened, they will raise the front portion of their body, spread their hood, usually hiss loudly, and strike in an attempt to bite, and defend themselves. They are often found in tree holes, and areas where rodents are more. Some of the monocled cobra have the ability to spit venom, this gives them the name, Indian Spitting Cobra. Let's have a look on its venom properties. The major toxic components in cobra venoms are, postsynaptic neurotoxins, which block the nerve transmission, leading to paralysis, and even death by respiratory failure. The major alpha neurotoxin in the monocled cobra's venom is a long neurotoxin. The monocled cobra causes the highest fatality due to snake venom poisoning in Thailand. Drowsiness, neurological, and neuromuscular symptoms will usually occur in the beginning. Hypotension flushing of the face, warm skin, and pain around bite site typically occurs within one to four hours after the bite. Paralysis, ventilatory failure, or death could happen rapidly, as early as 60 minutes in very severe cases. In a preliminary study, extract of mimosa pudica plant has been shown to possibly have neutralizing effects on the toxins present in this venom. So these were some facts, which will help you to understand the monocled cobra closely. However, these reptiles should be treated respectfully. If you encounter any snake, 
or reptile nearby, you should never try to hold them free hand, or kill. Call snake experts, or keep in your home snake catching tongs which will help you to grab the snake carefully, and move it to safe place, or make use of hooks, which also help you to avoid coming in direct contact with the snake. If you want to have these safety tools, the link is given in the description below. Thanks for watching the whole video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe with bell icon for more such interesting videos.